Well, if you've never played No Man's Sky, one of the features of the game that is very important is finding and exploring planets. There are over 18 trillion planets within this universe to be found and explored, and we happen to find ourselves on a volcanic planet right now. I have a bad feeling that there's going to be a storm popping off any moment now. I'm going to get back to the safety of the ship. Today, in this video, we're going to do a four-planet showcase. We're going to land on four of them, spend a few moments there, and then move on to the next. Check out that vol volcano. It looks like it might be ready to erupt. Let's get out of here. I am your host, Data One Before. Hope you're doing well, and let us proceed with our journey to some of the most sci-fi planets in the game. Our first planet is caustic with fungal mold, copper, ammonia, magnetized ferrite, and high sentinel activity. Beautiful colors. Looks like it might have a purplish sky with some greenish water. Let's go crashing into the atmosphere with a super duper dare devil descent directly down towards the planet. Let's check it out. Looks like we have some reddish, brownish type of environmental color with a purple sky and blue water. Very sci-fi indeed. I'm going to land the ship and why don't we spend a few moments listening to the ambiance of the planet. Planet number two is a dusty planet, cactus flesh, activated copper, pyrite, and magnetized ferrite. Why don't we head on in and see what we find on the other side of this dust cloud. It is very difficult to see. I have no idea where the actual ground is. These are the moments when you're piloting a starship and you have no idea where anything is. There's some kind of land. All right. Not available. Must wait for landing sequence to become available. As you can see, this is definitely a dusty planet. Initiating landing sequence. Uh, it looks like we actually found a landing pad of some kind. I'm going to step on out of the ship and let's enjoy the ambiance of this dusty planet. Headed towards a more tropical planet, we have starbulb, copper, paraffinium, cobalt, and high sentinel activity. The colors here seem to dominate in orange, so why don't we head on down and check out the environment. Looks like we are headed directly towards a crashed freighter that has met its demise on this planet. That is... Oh, look right next to a trading station. I'm going to take the free parking over here. Yes, indeed. All right, maybe some cool ship will fly in. The 
colors definitely look orange out there orange sky orange environment let's listen to the sounds of this orange planet Our final stop is to a grassy planet with star bulb, activated copper, paraffinium, and cobalt. The colors look to be a lot more yellow in the sky and aqua on the land or water. We shall see as we approach this final planet in the showcase. Definitely looks like there's a lot of green down there on this grassy planet, so that is awesome. With the yellowish, almost golden sky. Tall mushrooms scattered throughout the environment. All right, and lots and lots of very tall mountains. All right, some of these mountains are absolutely huge. And let's see if I can land this anywhere. Initiating landing sequence. Sometimes this ship does not like to land on a very steep slope. All right, I'm gonna head on out to this very interesting planet full of spectacular colors. Let's listen to the ambiance of the planet. Well, that was quite an amazing episode. Thank you very much for watching. I'm going to go back out exploring for more planets. We'll see you in the next video. I want you to have a great day and be safe out there. Bye-bye.